heart from Santa's sleigh, the last thing that we need. Without a doubt, I'm sure you know that you need water to make sense. Alright, so here we go. Buckets of water. I guess we gotta put these inside. dinner is Monday, but I'm going to be purchasing a batch of Slim Fast, I'm going to show you guys, I'm not going to spend too much, probably about $15, I don't know how much that's going to get me, probably the shake, canister, and a couple of drinks, and then I'm going to move forward with my hour day workout plan, which is kind of hard to do, considering that I live on the southern end of my county, and the gym is kind of like in the middle of the county, and it's kind of hard for me to get over there without transportation or whatever, but I'm still going to be work working on, I'm still going to be focusing on losing weight, so five hours a week. That's what I'm looking forward to. Yeah, what happened happen tonight, like duration wise, job wise, stability and permanency is what I'm looking forward to getting back on the and getting back to work. Because I had a job <laughs> set for tomorrow and they removed the ticket. I had a dentist appointment set for this morning and transportation canceled, so I was late to my appointment before I didn't go to it. And this smile is very important to me, you know? I'm looking I'm just going to have to learn how to balance and focus things out a little bit better. I think I'm going to start getting up calling them at 7 a.m. when I have transportation just to make sure they're on their P's and Q's because they're dropping the ball. And with transportation, if you don't remind them constantly, I think, you're not going to get to where you're going. So, yeah. Health insurance is health insurance, and they're doing their best, but they're not wow. top-notch. So, weight loss and health care go hand-in-hand with me. And like I said, new year, new waist, new smile. New hair, hopefully, because this stuff is rough. I want to eat. I want to get a sewing done, but I think I'm gonna start with party boot, and I'm gonna do it myself. And I'm just gonna do it long like this and get curly hair, cause I can do that myself. Now the party boot bags I show you over here. <laughs> party boot bags are of hair, like I think 18, 20, and 22 inches are like 20 bucks a bag, and I get two of those, and I double layer the wefts, and then glue it in, cause I'm not really good at sewing it, but I glue it in. The 18, 20, and then 22 like that. Probably with a split in the middle. Yeah, I don't know right now to show you, but it pretty much has the same look. So, yeah. I'm just going to go ahead and try and do that. And I just want to put these things in a direction of my channel so that it's moving forward. We're going to have a day where I'm doing my own hair. We're going to have a day where I'm working out. We're going to have a day where I'm working out. I couldn't find anyone to collaborate with me. What I'm basically going to do is start my own fitness challenge by myself. And I'm going to do a weigh-in every week, once a week, to see if I lose any weight. Because I kind of want to go pretty fast, but I'm not really sure how it works. I know when I was working at Santa Fe Gym, I worked out every day for months. Months and months and months. And I barely oh, lost. I lost it inches, not necessarily pounds. So I looked it better in a shirt. Like my, my stomach was behind my boobs or whatever. It wasn't sticking out. It wasn't protruding or anything like that. But... <laughs> the number on the scale just wasn't what I wanted it to be. I even bought one of those $350 elliptical machines from Kmart. You know, like I said, I used to work out an hour a night on that. And my last one burned so much. So I probably, I want to get back to that. And I want to lose some weight. And try to keep my hair and my nails done and stuff like that. Things that are going to make and make me look and feel better. And yeah. Those are also yeah, video concepts. Out, out for me to have those video concept ideas. Things for you to watch me do. And making the videos holds me accountable so that I can say, okay, if I don't do this for my channel, it's not going to get done. I'm not going to have content, and I'm also not going to lose any weight. So, yeah, that's what I'm working on. So, yeah, I'm hoping that works, y'all. I see everybody doing the goals videos, and I'm hoping that I can track. For my 2019 goals going in after Christmas, this is what I want. Number one, I want to buy Slim Fast. Number two, I want to start working out an hour a day. Five days a week. Number three, I want to do a weigh-in every Friday. Number four, I want to get my hair done every two weeks. Do it done myself. Number five, I want to make sure that I'm focusing fully, 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 fully towards my work responsibilities and either getting Serenity Virtual Solutions back up and running again because I worked on it for a couple months in 2016 or at least get Skip Day to where it can do customer service as well because I do have two EINs and I want to be able to do something. Let's talking about Serenity Virtual Solutions for a little minute. I used to work up under Rise.com. I don't know if you guys go through that or not. You may be able to, may be able to find me there still listed, but I don't get paid from it and so my business license is not active on their website. Like I don't think you could technically legally work up under my name. Their company is a little bit shifty, but for the most part it's one of those Facebook based internet businesses that don't always work out and then there's no one to call and complain when stuff goes bad. So I don't know if you know anything about Rise.com, but I know a lot about them. 
and I have had a bad experience. They did not back me up after my computer got stolen. They, they were not there for me at all. They had people working up under my name. And I'm just not there with it. So go get Serenity Virtual Solutions back up and running. Skip that has a phone number, y'all. I have a phone number. I might be changing locations hopefully one day. I'm praying to God on that. But right now, this little place is good for me, you know, because it's not as sensitive as most places and it puts a roof over my head. All right, so I basically listed five major points that I wanted to go ahead with. So I'm going <laughs> to revisit these a little bit later. But for right now, I just wanted to let you guys know that I'm open to collaborations. If anybody ever wants to do a video with me about anything, if you see me like on YouTube, the real, um, the real on Facebook. YouTube page, if you see me on there and you want to collaborate on a video idea, like a workout video idea, or you're doing makeup and you want me to try to do the same makeup as you do, or you're going to a grocery store, you're doing a Walmart haul, and you want me to do a Walmart haul, um, you're doing a wit call, you want me to do a wit call, um, you're doing a what happened to me during my pregnancy, I'm going to try to consider I'm looking for people on that page to network with so that I can build my channel through likes from that page and through connections from that page and also help other people build their channels because there's a lot of small YouTubers on that page and again it's the real one on YouTube too and I had a lot of fun doing the movie video last night my five top movies right, guys so basically that's it I just wanted to go over a few points with you guys today is the seventh day of Christmas I didn't get my purse guys but I did get to show you guys the one that I chose it was $89 it wasn't the 70 anyway so the answer to the question did I buy it mm, no, <laughs> I didn't have enough money. It's been a rough week, and any money I get is going to my kids, so yeah. Thanks for watching.